Hey guys, today I want to show you our cabin. I think I'm finally ready to show you everything. It took me some time to organize everything because the space is so so small and we need to live here for 10 months. So I'm always searching for tips for a small uh, space and I think I'm doing great with this cabin because before my previous cabin sometimes it was a mess now it's kind of better and I'm proud of my work Mario probably don't care at all but it doesn't matter and this is a not normal cabin this is a couple's cabin you can get this cabin only if you're a registered couple on a ship and it's not many of them on board and sometimes it's really hard but this contract we were super lucky we got it from the first day that we go out from quarantine it was amazing because sometimes you need to wait like a couple months or maybe half of the contract or sometimes they're giving you in the end of the contract couple coming so we was lucky this contract okay let's go this is how it looks outside we have a magnet lock and we can open with our sipas I will start from the door almost every time we have a shoe rug so we can put all of our shoes we don't have so many shoes I bought this little organizer here we have everything for exercises like a bands here I have things for my hair sunglasses and here is my little pharmacy I always traveling with this and I think one little more bag of pills because you never know. My biggest tip for uh, small spaces and especially for the cabins in the cruise ships it's having these hooks. Just buy a lot of these hooks and it will save so much space. It will help you a lot. Then we have here also hooks. Here's some of our bags and some of our sweaters. Down there we have a life jacket, a garbage bin for laundry, little seat, and here is the desk. Here we have a phone, and it's so funny on board, you're like back in 90s, you don't have iPhones, you need to call in the cabins to people, you're leaving messages, this is really funny. Here's all my hair product, my matcha, some things from my journal, deodorant, cream, and Mario's switch, and our computer. We're going up, and here we have my journals, my sunglasses, here is our name tags. Before we was using just name tags, but of course, with pandemic we need to always wearing a mask so when we're in a guest area we need to wear these this is really funny picture of Mario <laughs> and this is mine here I have my jewelry and Mario's jewelry some hair products this thing is so convenient it was costing like one dollar each and it really helped you organize the space here we have some card games and Nintendo Switch games of Mario and here is my makeup. I have one more here with my snacks. Of course I have a lot of teas and this is tea and this is tea and half of this box is tea or chocolate. Mm, cereal just in case <laughs> I'm super hungry and need to run to rehearsal. Here is more snacks. And here I have a mirror, our royal masks, and usually some cables inside those boxes, GoPro and all of those things. Under the table we have a fridge. Here's our fridge. Two days ago I was in Walmart, so I have good stuff here. I have a hummus and cheese and yogurt and my kombucha here I have my masks 
and roller. It's little, but it's more than enough. I also bought LED light and I feel it's really changing the mood of the room. Here we have the schedule for the week. Of course, <laughs> Izumi take out menu because Izumi is our favorite restaurant. We're eating there at least once in a two or three weeks. Another tip for the future crew members, all walls in the cabin is magnetic, so bring your magnet. It also will save your life. I was using that for photos, for schedule, schedules, for everything. I have a million magnets always. <laughs> Here we have a mirror, but you already saw that. We're always fighting for the mirror when we're dressing up with Mario because it's so little space. <laughs> now let's see bathroom. This is our little bathroom. It's so tiny. Here we have our cleaning supplies and a sink with a soap and our toothbrushes and toothpaste. Here is another mirror and we have of course here storage of a lot of things. Usually all my skincare or extra toothpaste and all that things. A toilet, another towel, and here is the shower. It's really small, but it is what it is. One of the random thing in a crew cabin is the beer opener in a toilet. Why? I don't know. We just recently talked with one of my friends about that, like, why in the toilet? You're just sitting in the toilet and then you decide to drink a beer? When I'm coming on board, usually first weeks, I'm always bumping my knees or my elbows in the cabin because we just not get used to so small space. But then you're getting used to it and everything's fine. Actually, I love our cabin. It's really cute and cozy. And next we have bed. That is the biggest thing that different from normal cabin and a couple's cabin because this is a luxury. A normal bed for the two people is actually a luxury in the ship. <laughs> this is our closet. This is mine and this is Mario's. In mine, I also put Two hooks here and another organizer usually i have here socks and tops and shorts right now <laughs> i don't have anything because we have a we have a laundry day here we have a shelf and then all my clothes but actually half of the clothes still in the laundry usually it looks like there is no space at all <laughs> And here I have the rest of my underwear, socks, and shorts, and tops. Mario is pretty boring because he has just basically a lot of t-shirts and shorts, but he also he have here a hook. Actually, when we come to this cabin, the, those hooks was already here. Thank you so much for the people who was living before us here. It's really convenient. Here I put another hook for putting more sweaters. Here we have a little shelf. Usually I have here a lot of, a lot of water, my cream, sleep bombs, Kindle, and here we have a light. Actually we have a light here also. I don't know for what. Ah, yeah, for another person. <laughs> this thing is actually a bed. Yeah, I don't know why it's here, but it is here. Let me show you. Go like this, and there is the bed. Okay, I'm missing my lights. No! Here I have a little bit of my photo. I forget to take all my Polaroids, and I'm still waiting for the new sheets, so I don't have so much photos, but soon I will have more. And I bought those lights, on AliExpress for like four dollars but they're so good also 
magnet magnet and it looks so nice here we have a TV usually we're connecting with HDMI to computer and watching our series on a hard drive or I connecting my phone and watching YouTube and also we have uh, free movies for crew like all of those movies and they change in that like once in a couple weeks or like three four weeks yeah but usually we're watching our series of course office 10 times parks and recreation five times community yeah i'm trying to stop mario from re-watching office 11 times because we need to have a break even though i really really love office under bed we have uh, some little storage space and all our suitcases is also there you can see one suitcase is here and that's pretty much it i hope it was interesting for you to see how our cabins look on board of harmony of the seas because some of the guests asking if we have the same cabins <laughs> as guests of course not no i wish Actually, I wish just for a window. Yeah, just for a window. Uh, I love my cabin, I just need a window. So I hope you like my video. Uh, I hope it was interesting for you. And if you want that I show you different kind of cabins on board, I can do it because my friends have a single shares, normal cabins also, and I can ask them help me with that. Just leave me a comment thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe me and watch another videos about my ship life and i hope to see you in the next video bye